Okay, so the Road Venture AT51, uh, made by Kumo. This is a tire that I researched on, did some research on, and a little uh, less expensive than the uh, BF Goodrich KO2. That's the tire that I was considering strongly, and for the price on these tires and some of the early reviews, there they just came out about a year year ago. So um, I thought I'd give it a shot. Um, this is the 32 R15, and they got a snowflake symbol on here, meaning that uh, they've been rated for winter weather. There it is, right here. Um, you can't really see that very well, but um, they've been reviewed well in that regard. They've got plenty of siping on them. You can see that center block's got quite a bit on it. They don't really make a lot of road noise, which is nice. Once you get up past 40 miles an hour, you don't even notice them. So, um, I've been happy with them so far. I will probably take them off road and see how they perform. Uh, doing a little climbing around, so forth. Maybe uh, later on this winter, or maybe next spring. I'll air them down. They got plenty of sidewall. This is the biggest tire that you can fit, like I said, on a Dodge Dakota without having to lift them up with a T bar and maybe a block or something in the back. But uh, so far, I've enjoyed driving them. They handle great on the highway, highway speeds. Um, I drove, uh, I've got 1500 miles on them roughly right now and uh, they've performed nice on the road which is you know that's a mixed it's an all-terrain tire made for oh I don't know probably 90% highway a little bit off-road roof so that's really kind of what I thought I might need so that's what I got but I'm hoping to be really impressed with them off-road too um, I guess on the Tacoma World uh, website, they've been compared favorably ag up against the uh, BF Goodrich KO2. So those that was a tire I was really contemplating getting, but this is what I ended up with. We'll try them out, see how they do. Um, but anyway, Kumo Road Venture AT51, and uh, hopefully I'll have some. Uh, rolling reviews of them eventually.